This is a request for Arx Matsy Relevant. It's not a real fanning video this time, but he wanted me to look at a couple of soccer related videos. This will be the first one. Now, I can't guarantee that this will be publicly visible. And if it is, it might not be for long because I don't know, these videos tend to get I, I don't know, I'm afraid of getting copyrighted here. That happens, I won't be able to post the rest, but we'll try it out. <clears throat> but this one is called Argentina versus Croatia 3-0 highlights resumen 4K. That mean resumen is a Spanish word for summary. S and then this one is in Spanish semifinal mundial Qatar 2022. Relato RCN. So this is 2022 World Cup. This is from the semifinal match between Argentina and Croatia. I remember I watched that with my parents. It's pretty fun. And this is a video by Rewind, Rewind Football. So this isn't from a major network. So we'll see if I don't get copyright claim or if hopefully the channel owner is fine with me doing a reaction for this. But if not, then I don't know what to do. <laughs> All right, let's start. This guy has an intro. It says T. Joe Ray 16. With us, and then it says suscribete. So my guess is this is a Spanish channel, but you know I I and I understand Spanish, and I'll try to translate the best I can. All right, so you can see this guy has a pretty nice introduction there. He's tell he's just asking people to subscribe to him and like his videos. I like the the bell effect when the mouse pointer clicks on the bell. It's pretty nice to hear that sound. And yep, let's get let's get started. You can see FIFA World Cup Qatar 2022. <clears throat> and let's get it into it. Argentina in Copa del Mundo. Alright, pretty nice stadium by the way. I like these stadiums. This one for the semifinal. Pretty pretty dope from the outside and the inside. I like the architecture, the um, and you can see a bunch of odd, a bunch of uh, lights. <clears throat> I like that blue light that kind of waves, that kind of wavy blue light you see towards the just under the the set of white lights. It's pretty nice. And then another set of lights underneath the wavy one. It's like a white and teal light. Pretty nice. It's a big crowd. It has to be expected. It's a World Cup event, so it makes sense. <clears throat> and, yep. You can see the people. There's people on the field. And what appears to be a large uh, rendition of the World Cup itself. And let's get right into the action. By the way, from this vantage point, it looks like the nets, the soccer nets are, for, the, for the goals are small. <laughs> but obviously, they're kind of big. Formado los equipos. Hoy con uniforme azul, un azul oscuro, con unos pisos ajedrezados sobre el hombro izquierdo para la selección. Ahí está Luka Modric, evidentemente lo que estamos describiendo para la selección de Croacia. All right, this guy right there from Croatia has a World Cup uh, replica there. So yeah, obviously they're rooting for Croatia. <clears throat> also heard mention of Modric, pretty good soccer player. I like him. Very talented player along with Messi. Yep. <clears throat> so you can see this is like I think this is like before the match started and they were just preparing. Y el uniforme tradicional del celeste, el otro azul, el azul celeste, un azul más claro, azul más cielo, las rayas verticales de la selección argentina. El uniforme tradicional de la selección argentina. So there's that rep the, that larger replica that I was talking about at the start of the video. I like it. And also they have a lot of things set out there. I think they also have the Argentina and Croatia flag. Because as you know, they always sing the national anthem of each country prior to a match. <clears throat> ay, ay, ay. Nos preparamos, señoras y señores, para lo que viene. Lionel Messi, Luca Modric, los capitanes de campo. There you go. Uh, Leo Messi, Modric, the captains at home. That's what the narrator said. Like I said, two very wonderful soccer players. They have definitely 
revolutionized the sport, historically speaking. And yeah, let's just watch <clears throat> as this unfolds here. Es el uniforme 2 de el uniforme alternativo del equipo croata. Va a tocar la pelota Croacia. Va a comenzar la primera semifinal del mundo. El ganador irá a la final el domingo, el perdedor el sábado para el partido del bronce. Va a tocar la Then you can see this is the the field position of all the players for Argentina. So, and also the narrator just talking about how this is like the the match for the semifinals. The loser of the match obviously went to third place playoff, and the winner, which is Argentina, went to the final. <clears throat> I just passed, but let me go back to it. So I find it very pretty cool how the coach for Argentina, the first first name is also Lionel, and Messi's first name is the same, exactly the same Lionel. Pretty cool. Para el partido del bronce va a tocar la pelota Croacia y en el relato del canal RCN el cantante del gol Javier Fernández. Señoras y señores, el fútbol para Argentina, Croacia, Jerenko. Primer cabezazo de Toto Tamendi. La pelota se va a sobrar Molina. Mete la pelota al centro. Segundo palo. No hay nadie. No hay ni había ningún hombre del equipo argentino. Y la pelota pasa de largo sobre el lateral de Oriente. Se repone a favor. La tiene otra vez de Paul Rodrigo que abre por sector derecho. Tiene que salir. Tiene que salir de atrás. Y va Kobe, Se queda con la pelota al arquero del conjunto de Croacia. Buen pase por el sector izquierdo. Taki Pico, el hombre que corría sobre la parte alta de la pantalla. I like how that lady has that makeup on her face with the Croatia flag. It's pretty cool. <coughs> All right, so now you're seeing the highlights of the of the football action, and just want to say pretty interesting editing from the from this from this channel, uh, channel owner. And all right, let's just see. By the way, there's a request from Matt that I also chant the goals. Now I'm not very good at that, but we'll give it a try. Mete la pelota al centro, viene cerrando Tagliapico y se va el tiro de esquina a favor del equipo. Por sector derecho, mete la pelota al centro, Yura Novi para el centro, segundo palo, se levantaba primero para el cabezazo Lobren. La pelota se iba, pero habían dos hombres que, que se estrellaban en el, equipo, en el equipo argentino. Se estrellaron los dos, se estrellaron los dos. Es un cabeza a cabeza, mire, ahí están. Los dos se estrellaron solitos cuando el cabezazo sí fue del Lobren argentino de media distancia, tranquilito, saliendo por la pelota de atrás, Lima Kovic. Parece que esa pelota incluso va para afuera, se va. Pero no quiso arriesgar nada el Ibacobis. Continúe, doctor Vélez, por favor. Sí, a Juranovic, el lateral derecho. Vélez y va a rematar, levantadita la pelota, va de largo sobre la última rollo. ¡Qué buena salida! Primer palo cuando debió haber sido al segundo. Ojo, va Álvarez, va Álvarez, va Álvarez, solo. Saliendo Álvarez, se alcanza a salvar Lobren. Alcanza a salvar Lobren. ¿Cómo dejan ese espacio totalmente solo? Ahí? That was pretty close. <laughs> <clears throat> Almost, but not quite. But you will see some goals later on. But as you can see, both teams are pretty talented. But obviously, I root for Argentina. Tarjeta amarilla penal. Claro, si le da amarilla es penal. Es penal. Es penal. And you can hear the the narrator saying how that was a yellow card penalty. <laughs> so yeah. It was definitely within the, the box region there, so yeah, it does count as a penalty for sure. Sí, por entre los dos centrales pasa. Se lo lleva es penalty. Clarísimo penalty. Viene el lío, qué golazo. Golazo. Goal! That was pretty good. Pretty well executed penalty. Ah! 
You can even see the people in the audience chanting goal. And there's Messi, very, very amazing soccer player for sure. So you can see Messi, he knows how to do these kinds of things. For him, this is this is just a typical day. <laughs> but yeah, very very good penalty shoot shoot out there. Oh, I like the way the, the narrator rolled his R when he was saying Argentina. Gente se mueve fino, juega mano a mano con el arquero y un penal bien sancionado. Palo están esperando Lobren y está esperando también Perisic. Le cobraron en corto, le levantan la pelota, balón que queda, salida otra vez, se entrevista para la cancha, salve atrás Lío, intenta Lío, se cayó solito, gana la pelota. It's very nice overhead shot of the entire field. <clears throat> oh, and by the way, if you're wondering what the narrator is saying, and a few moments ago he's just talking about how, you know, Messi's goal represents Latin America, South America, squaring one goal, giving him the advantage here for America. Yeah, pretty, pretty good. It was pretty well done. <clears throat> I liked it. Ojo por el sector izquierdo, va corriendo un hombre, va corriendo Maca por el sector izquierdo, va corriendo Maca. Hay un hombre que está fuera del lugar, saliendo Álvarez, Álvarez con la pelota. ¡Sale Álvarez! ¡Gol de Argentina! ¡Golazo! ¡Gol! Goal! Another, another amazing, another amazing goal from Argentina. <laughs> Whoa! I did not mean to do that. Did I? What happened? Oh, I went too forward by accident. Let's just watch it again. Va corriendo un hombre, va corriendo Maca por el sector izquierdo, va corriendo Maca. Hay uno que está fuera del lugar, saliendo Álvarez, Álvarez con la pelota. Sale Álvarez, gol de Argentina. I like that guy's reaction there. Algata <laughs> Juli. Oh yeah, this guy right there is a dedicated Argentina fan because he even got his face painted in the Argentina team's shirt co uniform colors there. And, and that wig he's wearing, that white wig. <laughs> so this guy, you can tell he's a diehard fan. <laughs> That's funny how how he runs he rams down the the creation goalkeeper. That was funny there. Not sure if you saw that. <laughs> that was funny. I think you might have seen it right there. It's a little bit hard to tell because it's to the left of the screen, but you could, you probably saw that. <laughs> he just like runs right into him and he drops them to the ground. <laughs> Jugando al contra 
ataque, el equipo argentino ha ganado 2 a 0. ¿eh? La pelota ha sido de Croacia, el manejo ha sido croata y aparecieron los goles. Aparecieron los goles así, de la manga. Esta es una jugada cuando Croacia... Otra vez para Baca, abre por saco, abre chocando, abre de Paul. De Paul mete un remate, pierna derecha, pega el hombre y perdió. Y se va el tiro de esquina a favor del equipo argentino. Pegó el perdió y pica el primer paro también. Y el cabezazo la salvó. Liva Kovic la salvó. Liva Kovic la salvó. That was a very close one. That was a very close one. Argentina's goalkeeper is pretty good. He, he did a great job with blocking all those balls. Didn't give Croatia a chance at all. <laughs> Dos a cero, faltan 45 y en el relato del canal RCN. Gente de Calvernatas le va a pegar de pierna derecha, pega fuerte, tranquilo, atrás. Le pegaba desde atrás el jugador. Está cargando de Fernández, viene el lío, viene el lío. Bien desde atrás, atento a Libakovic, lo aguanta Libakovic. Not a bad shot at all, but unfortunately it did go right into Croatian goalkeeper's hands there. Y si hay una falta que favorece el equipo de Croacia, infracción sobre Juranovic. That guy does not look happy at all. Se varon al centro, el cabezazo que de área saliendo otra vez. Luis Vivo recupera Martínez. Emiliano salvando al equipo. Acciones que el equipo que tiene el equipo croata en el espacio reducido. Hay falta y hay tarjeta amarilla. All right, well, looks like Christian Romero accidentally bumping into Croatian player there, so he did get a yellow card, but. Good news is he did stay in the game. Yes. Álvarez, Lionel, mm, se fue. Chao, papá. Viene Lionel. Para la brota, arranca Lionel por sexto derecho. Viene de atrás Lionel Messi. Va a tocar la brota en corto. Se devuelve. Gana la última raya. Ganó Lionel. Ganó Lionel. Toca el balón atrás. Oh, that was sick. Goal. Goal. Messi totally kicked their butts. He he just showed up his professional skills there. <clears throat> Those Croatian players had no chance at all. No chance at all against Messi there. Dodging them all like a pro he is. Yeah, I'm telling you, Messi's really good. And that pass was very good. And then this guy finished it off. Very well done, very well played. Everybody was in sync and it worked out just fine, just great. Argentina Álvarez! Que jugador talío! So you can see that play, <clears throat> that ability of Messi to outrun these players to evade them and then that pass to Alvarez who ultimately sealed the deal there yeah that was pretty pretty darn good And then you can see the reaction of the Croatian supporters, downhearted for sure. And I do feel bad for them, of course. It's understandable that they want their, their team to win. But, you know, you know it's, how, it's like they say, may the, may the best one win. In this case, Argentina was the best one. Esperando, Leo. Genio, te estábamos esperando, Genio. Y aparece el Genio. Con su magia. El Genio. Qué sacada espectacular, Bardiol no la viste nunca. No la vio nunca, Bardiol. Y Messi que se gana la raya. Qué jugada espectacular de Lionel Messi. 
Este es el Messi que estábamos esperando. Y el que le empuja es Álvarez, que solo tiene que ponerle la piernita para que la pelota vaya al fondo de las reyes, el tercero de Julián. Gran partido de Álvarez. Y apareció el genio. Se abrió la lámpara de Aladín. Y apareció Lionel Messi. Tres tiene Argentina. Cero tiene Croacia, Carlos Antonio. La veña para Lionel Messi. Y para Álvarez, que se lo merece. Profesor Juan José Peláez y doctor Carlos Antonio Vélez. En esta jugada, sí está Messi. Esta es la acción típica de Messi. Arranca, posesión de pelota, protección. Amague ir por dentro, luego lo aguanta, va a la final, se desembaraza de él metiendo el cuerpo, además protegiendo la pelota y el servicio justo para el remate de el definidor, del matador de este partido, Julián Álvarez. Bueno, este es un, es un remate de Perisic. Que... So you saw that very well blocked from very <laughs> Argentina goalkeeper doing a very good job. Deflecting the ball there. <coughs> Pero no llegan, no definen, no la meten. En el último cuarto no tienen lanzamiento a puerta. Como aquí Orsis, mire, por ejemplo. Esta y la pelota va por encima sin problema y repone Oka Modric para... Yeah, I think the Croatian players at that point were so desperate to try to score the goal that they were putting too much power in their kicks and they sent the ball right over the, the net. Not a chance. <laughs> tarde pierna derecha rebota en dos hombres Dina no hubo tal reacción del equipo por lo menos acá. Oh, tomaron al área y por poco viene el cuarto señores lo tuvo Maca está por that was very close but it did go a little bit off to the right there of the net but Argentina I think that Argentina had so much an advantage that they probably didn't have to worry that much anyways <laughs> clasificarse la selección pero si van la pelota al centro Saliendo para la marca, Batasta Cleapic. Levanta el varón al primer palo, pero al segundo palo y no pudo Lobren. Se la comieron sol. Se la comió lo... por derecha. Meyer con la pelota, pierna derecha. Bien, se tiene que estirar. Le pegó con pierna zurda, ras de piso. Y se estiró Martínez. Ahora este canto atrás para el. Yeah, not a chance for Croatia there. Right into the Argentina goalkeeper's hands. Blasic, Blasic intenta de pierna zurda, pasa de largo. Blasic, el número 13. Ahí está en su empate. Pegar Lobren. De pegar Lobren. Un tirazo que va por encima de pierna zurda. You see, Croatia trying too hard to score a goal, but they forget their techniques in the heat of the moments, and they're just sending the ball right over the net. <laughs> Señoras y señores, el árbitro ha dicho que este compromiso terminó. And just like that, Argentina defeated Croatia 3-0 in the semifinal Qatar World Cup 2022. <laughs> It was a really great match. I, I, I enjoyed watching it. A lot of very good work from both teams, but Argentina clearly did the best job here. And when it comes to soccer, I don't think Messi can get beat. <laughs> Pretty hard to find someone like Messi in that pairing with Messi Alvarez. Yeah, they got very good advantage there, for sure. So let's just... Watch the last few moments of the video and see how the reactions are for both sides. Es finalista, la selección argentina. Es finalista, un equipo suramericano en el mundial. Es finalista, Argentina, señoras y señores. Se van con tristeza de muchacho de Croacia. Ha terminado este juego, doctor Carlos Antonio Vélez y profesor Juan José Pelá. En el partido corto, 32 minutos, mucho mejor el equipo croata. En el partido largo, mejor Argentina. Después de que encontró el gol, cuando no se veía por dónde podía anotar y sale esa pena máxima, a partir de ahí el partido es otro. Ya ese es otro juego. Y en ese juego hay picos altos y picos bajos de Croacia. Pero sin, sin ningún peso en el último cuarto. Argentina sostuvo primero. Con... And that is the end of the video. You can see these. We have made it to the outro section. And this is, no, this is Spanish. Uh, you probably know what this is anyway. <laughs> the, this is like the thanks for watching screen. And then if you want to subscribe. And if you want to watch more videos, so yeah, that's, I mean, stylization is pretty good there. But yeah, <clears throat> very good job, Argentina, and they definitely did deserve 
the win of the World Cup 2022. And yeah, I'm going to go ahead and see if this will process without copyright issues. And I hope you enjoyed the reaction video. And we'll catch you for some more soccer related videos if this one does not have any issues. So thanks so much for watching and thank you, Matt, for the request. I hope you enjoy this a lot. I certainly did myself. Shout out to the Sia Travel for that notification. And we will catch you for the next reaction video pretty soon. So peace out.